And now, after I, I've put OBS 27.1.3, it has the audacity to tell me, oh, you can update, don't you want to update to 27.2? No. <laughs> Jesus. Yeah, other anything else worked perfectly until today with the, the OBS thingy. And the weird thing is that it freezes everything. Though I still can hear the, the music. Like the music, it's... Or audio. The audio works. Uh, back when I had the issues with the motherboard, with the ASUS motherboard, more exactly, uh, it froze everything. Like, uh, even the mouse, the keyboard, uh, were, uh, were out. And everything, yeah. Uh, freaking Windows. Yeah, yeah, it also did a small update. Doesn't have any sense. Uh, maybe it was Win Windows Update's fault. I doubt doub that, but it's okay. I'm sorry, friends, for uh, for those those issues. I wish I would know the. Oh yeah, I need to reconnect, reconnect, reconnect to the chat. Amazing. Uh, if you write anything, I'm gonna look on intermission. Until then. Oh, uh, docs chat. Connecting to chat. Oh yeah, I have to connect. Ah, uh, shit. Yeah, so if anyone is writing now, I will see that uh, below. Okay, log in. Yeah, I have to log in to Twitch. Amazing. And I need my two-factor authenticator thingy. Yes. Make sure you're not a bot. Pick a square. Are you kidding me? No, am, I, am I a joke to you? Twitch? No, that's not the password. Fuck, I forgot my password. <laughs> yeah, let me... This will take a bit. Just a bit. Uh, yeah, I really forgot my password. I'm not logging into Twitch that often. And I don't have... Uh, <clears throat> I use a lot of symbols and stuff. Uh, though it's a f fast fast phrase. I use uh, fast phrases for kind of everything. But I don't know where I put the symbols. So yeah, I need to... Yeah. Ah, now I remember. Yeah, now it makes makes sense. Yeah, I totally forgot about that. Okay, now the two factor shit. Pick the pick the octopus. Okay. Pick the oct. Come on, dude. Yeah, he thinks I'm some kind of bot because I tried too many times. Okay, now I'm connected to chat as well. <laughs> nice, I can see you now. Oh, yes, password, yes. Not like this. <laughs> Manage cookies. Damn the cookies. Okay. Oh, now it should be okay. I'm curious, does the poll work? Toggle poll. Nope. Toggle Paul. Yeah, I'm gonna update that later. 
Uh, I think I'm gonna update the poll after after the OBS thing works good. Until then, I'm not gonna do that because it's not uh, not even worth it. Okay, let's try more. What time is there? Oh, okay, it's still uh, it's still okay. I was looking at the time as well, but we just started. We, I just started the stream. <laughs> Oh no, I shouldn't have activated that. I forgot. Greedy! Yeah. <laughs> ABC one two three. That was a bad healing moment. This would have been a good healing moment, but... Eh. Yeah, I will use the poison only in the second phase, like when this phase starts, it's the best way because in the first one, I, I just want to make sure I, I kill him as it is. It, it will take more time to get through the first phase, but uh, I think using it in the second phase it's better practice because if I die in the first phase, yeah, whatever. And I can use it only in one phase, from what I understand. But that's fine by me. That phase actually scares the shit out of me. <laughs> okay. Yeah, that phase, that combo, whatever. That was bad.
No! That, that was really bad. I, I positioned myself in a bad way. Oops. Also, I see I have some drop frame now. Okay. I'm curious if the third crash was related to the same thing, by the way. Uh, before I, I continue. And I'm curious if it will happen again. Because I'm not doing anything different. Like, I'm not triggering something. Like, let's say a voice command or anything. Yeah, device setup manager. Yeah, I don't understand. So this happened at... Uh, yeah, nine and... Yeah, ten minutes ago. Give or take some minutes. Yeah. Doesn't make any sense. So yeah, I forgot what happened to him. Like, I know he... Like, his very old because this is a uh, way older like basically we time travel a bit here because he said still here so even the boss said oh you're still here <laughs> Hey, do the charge attack, please, sir. Yes, thank you. Oh, that would have hit me if I wasn't far enough. Yeah, this shit actually scares me. Nice. Oh shit, yeah, if you're in his face, of course. Yeah, whatever. Yeah, the light's favorite. Ouch. I'm not sure if the chat works. It should work. Let's see. Those... The redeems work also? Nice. Yeah, today is like the universe does, doesn't want me to stream, man. It's a sign. But I'm not gonna give up. So yeah, take care with the with the update. If it works well, that that means it was actually the OBS update. Oops. Yeah, I, I was looking at the stats because I was curious if... Uh, how do you call it? Okay, now that's better. Hello, sir. 
Yeah, it felt so epic as, uh, how he comes from, from that position. Ah, Gael. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, actually, you have a you have a hint that he'll do a two hit to there, the two hit attack. Uh, because he's uh, he's making a sound. I. Don't know where you are. Oh, that was good. This is no good. Too close to him. Okay, that was okay. I really like this fight again. Feels like a dance. A dance of swords. That was very risky. No. No. Oh, good thing that I was far away from that shit. In his ass. That hurt. <laughs> Fuck those trones, man. You don't impress me. Yeah, he shouldn't <laughs> like a woman. I just want to see how much I can resist to this. Yeah, never mind. Uh, I think it took like a million damage on this stage alone <laughs> uh, with a broken sword. Imagine, imagine this boss with a broken sword. Oh my god. Yeah, this is an endurance fight. I think I understood the second phase as well, more or less. Though I did some mistakes there. Mistakes, mistakes were made. Yeah, see when he when he 
when he said oh, when he does that he will attack two times and I didn't dodge properly um, and <laughs> you hate that attack you think it uh, wait this boss with a broken sword may lead to a broken mind <laughs> Dark Souls 3 broken mind run so gacha gas equals double attack yes oh <laughs> yes <laughs> the burp will secure him see he did the double attack but I didn't dodge it the right time <gasps> yeah that was a bad dodge But yeah, I prefer to use the poison in the second phase. It, it, it feels it's the better option. Or even in the third phase. I'm not sure. What do you guys think? Using it in the first phase feels a bit like a waste. He didn't do the... the uh. Too close, too close, too close, too close, too close, too close. Okay, that's not... He, he made the... Uh. And he didn't do the double attack. Okay, so that's no hint actually. It's more confusing than hel than that helpful. Ah shit, too far. The Pepega. Where did you go, bro? Right in the ass, did you see? Though, yeah, I, I used way too many Estus here. I feel too uh, too embarrassed to show my face after that attempt. Oh no. Oh no. You know what? I'm gonna exploit this shit. Well, if I'm not... if I won't die... That was so damn bad. Uh, yeah, when you're too over overconfidence is a slow and insidious killer, though here it's a very flat fast. <laughs> I almost said flat. It's a flat and insidious killer, yeah. yeah. I'm gonna use one here, and then I'm gonna use one in the next. I found a window where I can use it. Fucking god. No!
Yeah, when I... I think when I use the poison, I play worse. <laughs> I don't know why. It poisons my mind. Rest in pepperoni. Oh, man. At least the stream works. I have some drop frames there. I don't know why. Doesn't make any sense. So, in the first... In the first two parts of the stream... For now, yeah. Too far away. Dude, that, that was bullshit. I'm sorry, but what the fuck was that animation? And this is well, he turned... He turned 360 degrees, what the... Wait, second phase again? <laughs> oh, look at look at him. Yeah, it it's not worth to use the to use the poison the first phase. I'm gonna waste a lot like that. I wasted a lot anyway. Fifty-eight. Okay, yeah, I, I'm gonna use it in the in the second phase only. At least that way I can learn more in case I don't beat him. Can't I read that move, man? Uh, yeah. It's like my brain had a stroke after three crashes. <laughs> uh. <laughs> hmm. Yeah, I'm thinking of how I should do it. Well, besides dodging <laughs> at the right time. Um, so, I think when I get confident, I can just spam the poison. I can use it in the first phase. Then I wait for it to pass. And then I'm going to use it again when I have a window. Because I, ha I saw, at least in the second phase... Uh, you actually have some windows for, uh, where you can uh, uh, heal, or, but usually you need to stay far away from him. But for now I don't feel that confident. Yeah, this is what annoys me a, a bit. That I cannot dodge that move uh, with the uh, with the walk, you know, to to save a bit of stamina. But yeah, this one. I think it's time to heal at least once. I 
I know that's a risky move, but after all... If it works... Why not? It was a challenge for me even back then for with the stamina management. Imagine now <laughs> with the stamina. Yeah, this is my favorite move to dodge. It's a very straightforward dodge. was a very bad positioning. He does the spinny spin. No. Yeah. Do I have enough time? That hurt. Oh, I forgot. So he has the jump, then he lands, he does the spin, and then uh, the front trust i forgot how long those combos are though that attempt wasn't bad i uh, i was tricked by the fact that uh, it had the uh, how do you call it uh, that it had a, a smaller combo Stream crashed uh, two more times. <laughs> it's okay. Uh, it might be the newest version of OBS. Like, that might be the problem. The stupid thing is that... Shit. Yeah, this <laughs> this is the stupid thing. <laughs> oh, uh, I managed to reach the third phase several times. It, it's not as hard as I thought, though. 
Uh, I forgot uh, that it had uh, in the third phase. The boss has, uh, what's the, Gale has way more uh, moves in his combo than uh, that uh, than I remember. It. And uh, I died because I for I. That was my fault, though. But uh, yeah, I forgot. Also, welcome back to you. Ah. I could have hit him at least. Yeah, I died like a fucking stupid shit. Uh, he's uh, very lively in final, yes. <laughs> yes. Uh, yeah, you don't have many openings, let's see. But, uh, yeah. Uh, you went for a jog. Ooh! I didn't know you do jogging. Feeling refreshed. Very nice, man. Uh, here it's a, it's still a bit too cold to do jogging. And uh, I want my lungs and stuff <laughs> intact. Uh, I used to do a lot of jogging. Are you kidding me, dude? Bad God, it's so annoying when you when you you when you die because of a bad heal or get hit because of a bad heal. Yep. Yep, it was that heal. <laughs> if I didn't even try to heal, it would have been good. Ah. Uh. My record is 20 kilometers of jog jogging. <laughs> I, I brag about that a bit. Actually, almost 20. I think 21, yeah. I wanted to do, do a half marathon, whatever. Yeah, like, without pauses and stuff. The pace wasn't fast. Like, I, I took double the time of, uh, <laughs> of what an athlete would take from what I understood. Like, I know someone makes a half a marathon in one hour. I did it in two hours. Uh, I had the pace of mm, a kilometer per six minutes. So, yeah. Compared to my... I don't know, five kilometers runs, that is quite slow. And yeah, I'm not using poison. I'm not sure what your uh, strategy was, uh, uh, Bromine. But uh, I'm not using poison the first phase. It's better for training, in my opinion. That hit always hits me. Whatever I do. Come on, second phase already. If I reach the... the like, close to... No.
That was bad. <laughs> um, uh, get better reading him first. However, you should have a lot of the buffs in stock since you have, um, since uh, you should have bought many instead of leveling. Uh, uh, yeah. Actually, oh yeah, I forgot. Um, a half-life piece of shit didn't give me. Uh, did it give me souls? I forgot. If it gave me souls, I lost them. <laughs> Fuck. Ah, uh, whatever. Yeah, I have like 40, I think. Ah, 54. Nice. Yeah, it should be fine. I'm not gonna do me dear today, though. <laughs> e even if I beat this guy right now, I'm not gonna do me dear now. Yeah, if only 50, then yeah, just save them until you, you're uh, in, you're getting better. Yeah, uh, I I want to save them. My opinion is that if I get them the second phase, uh, I can um, I can use it when I have a free window in the second phase. It would be awesome if I uh, do it right before the third phase. That that would be something. Uh, but that in only if I feel I'm confident enough. But yeah, th this is one of my favorite fights as well. My favorite fight from the DLC? Yes. Totally. Because it reminds you of Art Artorias. He even has a rage stance like he has. Like Artorias had, uh, whatever. You get the idea. And of course I'm healing and stuff because I still want to reach uh, at least the second phase. In the first phase I'm dying just because of not paying attention, but that's it. There I was greedy. I shouldn't have attacked him there. Second phase? Yes. Hey, welcome, spider. Hello. Uh, this is Slave Knight the Gale, uh, uh, spider. It's uh, the last boss in the game. Well, not for me, though. Okay. Oh, no, that was bad. That was bad as well. Uh, beautiful music, looks amazing, feels amazing to execute, super cinematic and climatic, good lore. You've, it's got it all, yes. Did you on the Demon Prince though? Thank you. Thank you. How are you, Spider? Welcome. And uh, then we have uh, Dark Eater Midir. Which is... Uh, like, this is the mandatory DLC boss. Well, DLC isn't even mandatory, but you get the idea. Snake to the welcome, sir. All of them, except Medir and this one. Actually, no. I've defeated all of them except Gael and the Medir. And we will do Gael today. So, yeah, I killed. Yeah, I killed all of them. The two worst ones. Nah, this isn't worse than Frida. <laughs> Trust me. How are you, Snake Dude? How are you feeling? I hope better with the... 
with the with the chest uh, issue. Ah, uh, trust me, I actually do decent at this boss. I thought I'll do really bad. Well. The, uh, here I didn't focus, but it's okay. I, I just enjoy this fight. <laughs> For example, the half-light half uh, fight I didn't enjoy that much. But this is a masterpiece. From software, you have my respects. Also, for whoever is a streamer here, please take care of the 27 uh, plus point two update of OBS. Like, for me, it... it Froze my PC, it crashed. I, I'm not sure if if it crashes again. <laughs> if my PC crashes again, then it's not from that OBS version. Greedy. Okay. okay. was very lucky. I guess I did decent. Could be better. Uh, will having the week off, you just relax and don't use your left arm for much other than typing. <laughs> w a s d ing in games, and it feels to be. It seems to be working. Surprised you survival normal hit with a cape as well. <laughs> yes. Uh, the first time you fought Gale, you used the Lido's great hammer, not knowing he was weak to crushing damage. And you wonder why people were saying he was so hard. Uh, I don't feel like he's hard, but... Uh, if you have a bad... Uh, yeah, just kill me. Please. I accept death. The greed. <laughs> uh, actually, I'm not sure if it was greed when I died. Was it? There, I was greedy in another circumstance, but it worked. Shit. Nope. Not at all. For example, even here I was greedy. If I... 
Why? But I'm a man of action. Well, and death. Kill yeah, exactly. In the third phase, I really must be careful. Even here, actually. I'm curious how you did it. In, uh, do you have any recording on this of this fight in <laughs> in uh, SL1 New Game Plus Seven? Uh, I'm always too close when this happens. Maybe. I would li like to see that. Yeah, that was greedy. This was greedy as well. I could have hit him only once and that, that was it. Yeah, I didn't. I didn't expect that. Oh no! That was just bad healing. I'm really curious if you have one. It Oh, hello there, sir. That was a bad dodge. And maybe greed as well. But I'm starting to get more consistent in my runs. You did uh, highlight it. It's not New Game Plus 7 though. First SL1. It's still good. If you, wanna, you, if you want, you can link it up here. And I'm gonna watch it. Very nice. Final boss, Slave Knight Gale. I'm surprised that didn't stagger me though. Okay, let's let's watch it. Toggle display. Toggle display. Let's stop the soundtrack. Let's watch. Okay, this is what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna swap. Okay, oh, you didn't have the... you had this one to be a bit more protected. Nice. I'm gonna swap one of them and I'm gonna try a fight. Eight minutes? Okay, here. actually I could use a break, so l let's, let's let's watch him do it. Because I feel like if I can just make my Estus last a bit longer, the third phase will be doable. Yeah, that that's what I said as well. <laughs> Ah, okay, so you started with, uh... Oh, shit, you got hit there. Ouch. Okay. You have the best injury back then? Doesn't matter, man. I love the glasses, anyway. <laughs> you get hit a few times. I'm surprised you got hit in the first phase, though. 
uh, when I first uh, played the game, it took me three hours, but I consistently, uh, how do you call it? I consistently uh, beaten this guy in the first phase without getting hit. Oh. But uh, as you can see at this point, <laughs> uh, when you first play, the, you beat Gale on third try. Oh my god, Omega damage. Okay, good. Okay, got hit only once in the first phase. That, that is pretty good. Oh, okay, so you did the, you did do it as well. So you use it when. Okay, this is what I do as well. Go in his back until the. Ah, shit. Yeah, that, that's annoying. But didn't damage you that much. Okay. I try to stay close to him when he does that. Here you almost got hit, but you didn't. Ooh. You, you, you didn't expect the stagger and you dodged. I, I did the same so many times. Ouch. Yeah, now, yeah, now we need to get back. Ah. Yeah. That happened to me as well. Oh. Okay. Oh, you jumped there. Ouch. Oh, King, King Somnus. Hello. Hello, sir. <laughs> Hello. Welcome. How are you, my friend? Okay, you did actually very damn good. Also, you have 14 Estus. I have 9. <laughs> so maybe that's why. Oh, okay, I missed time that. I want to see how you did the the second phase, uh, the third phase. How how's your beard? Wait, what? Beard is good, actually. <laughs> okay. Everything is going well. I'm. Uh, we are looking at the uh, Dio, uh, Tio's uh, video during this boss. I'm uh, attempting right now in Soul Level One. You will never be able to have one genetics. Actually, oh, oh, oh! Did you got hit by the the thunder? Unless you're kind of embarrassed with this play, you're much better. At th yeah, they, yeah they, do you want to see how I kill this guy in my normal playthrough? And you can compare how I play now compared to how I played back then. <laughs> in my opinion, I, I played like shit back then. But uh, I, I finished Dark Souls with no back sitting, no nothing. Yeah, you can attack him at least twice when he, when he's like, what? he has like a small cooldown. He must cool off. <laughs> uh -oh. oh, that that was nasty. And you blocked yourself into the that shit throne, whatever thing. Yeah, not a good place to fight. Uh. Yeah, I, I would go in his back as well. Then wait for this. Yeah, you got him. Well, in New Game Plus 7, you're you're not allowed to be this greedy. <laughs> I'm curious if everything one-shots you, New Game Plus. Not everything. I mean, for example, that hit. That hit he last did with one shot you. I'm surprised that the new game plus seven. Loving the mount movement he has uh, while playing. Yes! <laughs> Boom! <laughs> Someone clip that for me. <laughs> Let's go, boys. Soul level one, Dark Souls three. Complete, and I'm pretty sure I've got a <laughs> sneaky feeling that I beat my boy Zombies Creed. Pipped him at the finish line, didn't I? <laughs>
<laughs> Very nice, man. Let me show you how I did it. <laughs> uh, in my normal playthrough, it, it is very damn bad. Do I have any copyright? No. Copyright claims. Okay. Be prepared for a shit play. <laughs> Took me 12 minutes. <laughs> 12 minutes. Look at my face. I am so disappointed. <laughs> <laughs> You're racing. That's the face and pose of sound about no. That's the face of disappointment. Yeah, that's the face of disappointment. <laughs> uh, also, my English was way worse. My audio was way worse. Look, look at my HP, dude. I didn't reach in any Dark Souls game. Well, that's true. And I thought this will make me rage. Yeah, it didn't make me rage, but I felt really dead inside back then. <laughs> also, look at... Uh, you will be surprised, but... How, how do you call it? Yeah, I usually don't rage. I rage at online games, but that's why I don't play online games. Five head, I rage at online game. Also, because you can I'm see the dead number up there. People that suck so much. And no, I don't like blaming people, but usually it's their fault. I don't like blaming people, but it's usually their fault. <laughs> More in logic. We lose a team-based game when people play like individuals. Uh, but yeah, that's true. That, like, that's what annoys me at online games. So th this doesn't annoy me. This only disappoints me of my own skills. Yep. So after I beat this boss, I will feel hollow. Uh, little I knew back then that I will actually feel hollow after I that kill Midir. <laughs> uh, so 283 deaths. I think that's a decent number for a first blind playthrough. Let, let me put from here because it's a fucking long fight. <laughs> like 14 minutes, man. <laughs> 13 minutes and 28 seconds to be more exact. Let's see how I played it here. Pretty bad. I think. Though, this is after 3 hours of fighting this guy. So imagine. Uh, you would be surprised, but I feel I do more damage with the sword. You play more safe here than SL1. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, in SL1 I'm more... I don't know. I was scared, okay? Sorry about that, Estus. Yeah, I, 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 I was really obsessed with Estus flasks here. Like, to not waste even one. Yeah, here I feel, feel more confident. Uh, in SL1, I mean. At uh, this part, I didn't feel that confident. No, 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 no. Fuck, no. Yeah, he, here I made uh, some a bad. Uh, yeah, he loved the effect when the lightning hit. By the way, when the lightning hits him. Uh. Does he get damaged? Uh, yeah. There you shouldn't have dodged in the front, mate. Oh, really? I thought, uh, yeah, look at the damage I deal. It, it feels way less than the damage I deal uh, in SL1. <laughs> well, in the first playthrough, I mean. Because it's a very slow weapon. Like, with a very fast weapon, you can, you can do way more damage. But with the, with the Ultra Greatsword, Yeah, here. 
also I'm I had an old gear because I, I wanted to dodge better. <laughs> so let's say I was training for this for SL1 since then. But yeah, th this is the actual first playthrough. Amazing stuff. Yeah, here I, here I was playing overly safe. Hey, Perseus, is welcome. One of these days, you're gonna, you'll attempt to play this. Ooh, that sounds really nice. I'm gonna wait for it. No, how are you, Perseus? Hello. Ouch, that was bad. There I was like, oh, I'm, I'm gonna hit him, man. I'm gonna, and I didn't hit him. <laughs> This is why it took me so much time. I played very safe. After work, I'm not feeling well. I'm sorry to hear that. I hope you have to, some time to rest and get well. Maybe get some days off if you can. Like uh, uh, medical days off, I mean. Ah, but uh, wait, <laughs> but wait, let me show you the cringe fest. And thank you, sir. Coming from you is a big... Uh... <laughs> I'm so dead inside. <laughs> oh my god. This will be the last boss for our run, by the way. You will be surprised to see how I killed him. Uh, I have an idea. I need to take a pause. So until I uh, until I come back, you watch this. Be right back.
fucking hell. Oh, I blocked myself.
I forgot about that, yeah. I'm sorry. Oh man, when here we am. <laughs> I didn't say anything, I'm sorry. <laughs> Yeah, I, I said that uh, people, some people backseated me throughout the mid-year fight and it annoyed the hell out of me because I really didn't want any of that. And they were telling me, like, oh, you mean you can hit the head, you can, yeah. and I was like, you know what, I'm not gonna hit the head. <laughs> no, uh, jokes aside, it, it, that was a small part of it, like, uh... Whenever someone tells me to do something and I don't want to know, I do the exact opposite. For example, someone came in at Pontiff. No, no, when I when I had first played through there, I don't know, man. People were, like, attracted to the first playthrough and no backseating, and they felt the urge to backseat. Annoying. He, here I accept backseat at, with some extent. But if you come to me and tell me, you can do that, you need to dodge that, you need to... that annoys the hell out of me. Only if I ask, like if I ask, go nuts, tell me absolutely every inch of detail. And uh, I felt I wasn't safe uh, tr with the head uh, stuff. Basically, I didn't learn him enough to, uh, to be able to do the head hits. Uh, SL1 will be a treat then, yes. A treat for the ones watching. Yeah, I really don't know how to fight me, dear. So, yeah. But as you guys said, it feels easier <laughs> than uh, Frida, I hope. With its multiple phases. Well, at least me, dear, is, has two phases. Um. And I was hitting the tail because I, I I just got used to that. That was it. How didn't that hit me? Well, I should stop asking questions. And be happy that I didn't get hit. Ouch.
Greedy! That was greed. Pure greed. Pure <laughs> greed alert. No. Drama alert with Killer Kim Star! Oh no. The greed alert. I, I will make an emote with that, man. I swear to god I'm gonna make an emote with that. I have some emotes coming up, by the way. I must talk to you, the one I uh, I commissioned. Hey, bloody guys, welcome. And so it ends. So sad you can't stay to watch. Came to greet you and wish you good luck. Thank you. Thank you so much, friend. Uh, this is not the end. I'm gonna do me deer as well. So this isn't the last one. This is a one punishing boss fight, yes. But I, I enjoy it. Masochistic much? <laughs> Kappa. One punch gale. <laughs> mean dear, another sexy fellow, yes. <clears throat> This is your favorite fight in the entire Soulsborne franchise? I can't see why. It's a very well done fight. The AI is really good. The animations are top notch. Music is great. Actually, music is great almost always. Like I have some, no, no. For example, the Half Life. That was uh, shit. That was shit as well. Uh, this one died with poison at your end. <laughs> yeah, we're using poison. Uh, yeah, uh, those extra combo hits are your downfall too. You're a casual. <laughs> You're not a casual, man. You kill? Did you kill him without any summons? For me, summoning in the first playthrough is a bit casual, but I don't see actually casual. <clears throat> summoning in the first playthrough kinda ruins the idea of the experience, in my opinion. But I, I, I never consider a casual a bad thing, like those elitists in the Souls community. Like, oh my god, you're a casual so bad. I don't care, man. I thought the uh, second phase would start. Well, it started, but yeah. No, that. Uh, why? Why, man? Why? Why the greed? Why the greed? Uh, you ran around the ruin and poison. No summons here. Uh, you can summon. You really change the fight when you uh, co-op it, but it's still fun. Yes, I totally agree. It's fun to play in co-op. That that's why they added it. It adds actually something very special to the game. I I didn't play co-op that much. I'm not gonna lie, but when I played, it was really fun. 
Like if you want to play Dark Souls and don't not stress too much about stuff, you can you can play with a friend that know how to play, and that's it. And they will carry you, and you will still enjoy Dark Souls without actually having to <clears throat> struggle that much. That that's my take on this. Uh, we beat too far. Oh, that's good. Shit. Shit. Uh, uh, it's worth playing the game by yourself as well. You only call up with watchers in Frida, rest summon NPC were available. Uh, that's what the casual is. What do you mean? In the Sunlight Covenant, it's all about Jolly Corporation. And it's probably one of the most popular in it in the series, despite the elitism in the community at times. Actually, the community isn't that elitist anymore, as it as it was. Like, they realized, those elitist guys, realized that <clears throat> it's actually shitty to be like that. Of course, there are some people that are like, mm, you, you want to summon, you suck. Yeah, those guys actually suck. I was asking some uh, info on the Dark Souls server. Some of them were actually very nice, but others were like, Oh my god, learn and play and learn. Don't ask me, noob. <clears throat> Yeah, the elites are a vocal minority in most probably, yeah. A person who doesn't want to bother learning how to learn how to play so they summon others to do the job for them. Nah, not really. You... I think you judge too harshly, but that's your opinion. I see it as something else. Like, uh... Like, <clears throat> liking to play a, a game co-op doesn't mean you don't want to learn the game. It depends on the patience on, of the person as well. Maybe some people don't have the patience to go through all that shit. I don't know. Oh my god, that, that big boy. Uh, but yeah, what I want you to say is that being a being a casual player isn't a bad thing. will just realize it sucks to be like that. It just alienates people from wanting to play the game or join in multiplayer. Even in League of Legends. Uh, like, everyone knows. Now everyone knows that League of Legends is a piece of toxic trash and avoid it. <laughs> just because of that. Same for Dark Souls. Like, they see it has a reputation of a very hard and difficult game with an elitistic uh, community that uh, is like, eh, whatever, do, do stuff yourself. And... Uh... 
Yeah, he didn't do that right. Um, not to, not specific to Dark Souls. Uh, and if it's not League of Legends levels of popular, it can be a death sentence. <laughs> can be a death sentence for the game. Yeah, exactly. Uh, but when you take shortcuts, you cheat not only the game but yourself. <laughs> Again, I don't see summoning as a bad thing. I see summoning in the first playthrough as a half bad thing. For the player, of course, that will miss some... Um, uh, how do you call it? That will miss uh, some experiences, but that's it. Like, uh, I don't judge anyone by their... Uh, <clears throat> Oh yeah, if you if you suck at the game, and if you complain about the game, yeah, then I then I will judge you. <laughs> then I will judge you. But uh, if you're not complaining that the game's, uh, if you're not blaming the game for your own fails, then it's okay. I have lag, man. I died from the from the cape. Who summons just because they want to summon and not because you're struggling? Uh, wait, some would argue that even a bow or a spell means taking a shortcut. Uh, yeah. Well, actually, some challenge runners use the bow in uh, Dark Souls uh, 2. Dark Souls 2 challenge run. Uh, so, yeah. My opinion is this. If you play the game without actually using cheat codes or whatever, you play it with whatever the game has to offer you. You can summon, good. You can, uh, you can uh, summon NPCs, you can summon players. Uh, it will, I, I don't know. If you can do it in game, why the fuck not? Yeah. <laughs> You know, do any other difficulty didn't turn me, me turn you off of souls. The community did though. Well, and s look where you are now. <laughs> Such a good damn player, man. You see the point of summoning, unless you want to help a sun bro level up their covenant. Dude, co-op is fun. That's the point of summoning. Some people are like uh, are like this. Some people like to play games only with with someone. Doesn't matter with whom. In a team, in co-op, my my nose was stitchy and I died. So that's the point. But uh, I feel explaining this uh, in this situation it's useless, so I'm gonna stop. Uh, yeah, exactly, exactly what Beard is with as well. Like, uh, exactly what Beardo said as well. Just for fun. I did some... S I summoned a friend in uh, Dark Souls 2. Just for fun. And I think I summoned uh, them also because I was in... Uh, New Game Plus 4 or something with the... Um, with uh, the Ancient Dragon. Like, uh, I needed the Giant Souls. And I killed the ancient dragon to get them. It was horrible.
But yeah, summoning is fun. That's uh, like there is even a video on that. The Happy Souls uh, with Dark Souls 1. <laughs> Don't dodge in the front. I'm talking with myself. Uh, you... Wait, wait, wait. Wait, I'm sorry. Um, just for fun, it changes the game uh, a bit doing co-op. And it can be the, the way some people just prefer to play it. Exactly. Panic Basket. The sunken DLT. <laughs> Actually, I liked it until the... You know, the temple with uh, the phantoms until I found those. Oh my god. You love hate the deal, uh, Dark Souls 2 DLCs. They're so good, but hard as fuck. Oh yeah. Bow only is hard as fuck. I, I actually never tried that. You know, sometimes go out because you want to play with a friend and just fool around. Yeah, exactly. You usually have an easier time fighting the boss solo, but it's more fun to play along someone. Exactly. Some of your best Dark Souls memories were playing the, the true Dark Souls 2 with a friend. Good times. Oh yeah, Happy Souls. Yeah, exactly. You did this Happy Souls, uh, uh, Tio. <laughs> that combo, though, yes. Yes. So, yeah. That's, uh... <clears throat> that's my take on co-op in Dark Souls. And, uh... I felt the rat... In Apprentices, I mean. The rat of... Uh... In the apprentices, uh, like the wrath, because it wasn't that bad, but yeah, the toxicity, let's say, of the elitism of some people in the community, but meh. Others are very supportive and very open minded, which is what I mean, you mean. For example, it's Killerman. You, do you guys know Skillerman? He's the admin and owner of the Dark Souls server. He's a very nice guy. He joined my streams as well some time ago. Uh, he also was streaming at some point, but I think he gave up, or maybe they came came back to it. I, I don't know. Didn't watch them for some time. And uh, they were actually very very welcoming, and I uh, I uh, I felt uh, I felt nice on the Discord. I'm still on that Discord. Like I usually leave times up. Good, uh, good luck, more hand. Thank you, bloody Gus, and have a nice evening, my friend. Uh, that was greedy. Evening, my friend. I want to see that. Uh, that was greedy. <gasps> Interesting. A little bug there. <laughs> Do you, do you consider this guy a villain, by the way? I'm curious. This is what I like about Dark Souls. I don't think there are uh, villains in this game. Except Pontiff, fuck Pontiff. <laughs> Chandra? Yeah. Maybe. 
it's a bit debatable in her case. Ooh, uh, villain? No, poor exploited soul holder tirelessly to fulfill his master's wishes. Gwyn? <laughs> Gwyn is the villain? Apart from Gwyn? Really? You consider Gwyn as a villain? Interesting. I didn't see him as a villain. I don't think uh, this guy's a villain anyway. He, he's just old and senile. <laughs> also, I find interesting the. Do you see the hole in his uh, chest? I'm thinking of what that represents. Stop a bit, I wanna see your. Yeah, look at that. What happened there? Did a lot of fucked up shit. Uh, patches. <laughs> yeah, patches is a shithead. I I would. Uh, mm, patches is yeah. Uh, let's say a, a minor villain. Let's see. Just to keep his reign going. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. So let's say Gwyn is a villain. Some someone else. I'm dead. Yeah, I, I can't. I, I just can't do that one. This guy became like this to protect something. Yeah, but what? The Ring City exists because Gwyn imprisoned the dark pygmies here after enslaving them to enslaving them to fight for them. Nito? Nah, Nito is not a bad guy. He's just the first that first of the dead. Like, basically, the, like, Hades? I don't know. Like, the god of death? Something, something? Uh, most bosses' enemies in Dark Souls are old and senile. <laughs> you know the knights walking around outside with the holes inside their chest? They're the, uh, they're the same as Gale? Yes. Yes. Aren't most of them mad and hollow? If demons count as villains in Dark Souls, they seem about as chill as anyone else, really. Uh, the holes in their chests were, I forget exactly, either the dark sign curse literally manifesting within them, or the curse Gwyn placed upon them to keep them enslaved, which became the dark sign curse. I think you might be right. I know it's, a, it's related to the dark sign curse, but because it's literally the dark sign, <laughs> it looks like it. It's a damn circle. That guy is pretty nasty, Aldrich. Oh yeah, he's he's a shithead as well. Yeah, with uh, another one. Okay, so let's say Gwyn, Aldrich, Pontiff. Like Pontiff is is a bastard as well, like enslaver. Not sure what to think about Frida. 
she doesn't seem to be the villain, but she's a bit too overconfident and a bit annoying as a character sometimes. She's like, eh, I'm, I'm gonna kill this Ashen one. You're an Ashen one as well, you fucking bitch. Gondir is not a bad one. Pontiff and Gwyn, I would say, are 100% uh, actual bad people. Real villains. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, I don't know what are Pontiff's uh, reasons. Gwyn at least uh -huh. had a reason. Gwyn at least had a damn reason. But Pontiff? Demons don't count as villains. I misclicked. I misclicked. I misclicked. Oh no. That that was that was painful. Yeah, I wanted you dodge, and instead of dodging, I I just clicked. <laughs> I, I just clicked the the other thing. Pretty they failed in the king in king the five. Calling them. What do you mean? I'm calm. Am I not calm now? I'm just focused. I think I'm pretty calm. <laughs> Ouch. They're kind of chaos incarnate. They don't... Yeah, yeah, they... I, I would say the Witch of Isolate is also... Chaotically evil because if it wasn't there, the demons wouldn't be such a big issue now. Oh, yeah, I know. The serpents. Fucking serpents, man. Those are the true villains. Uh, you think the demons are just kind of chaos incarnate? They don't specifically represent evil or bad. They're just demons. Being demons. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Heart rate monitor when? Do you want me to put a, 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 a money goal for that? <laughs> I, ju I just save money for a GPU. I'll get the GPU as soon as possible. Whatever the price it has. At uh, the moment when I have the money saved, I don't give a fuck about prices lowering up. I don't know when that will happen, and I'm sick of waiting. That was bad. So yeah, the the snakes, the serpents, primor primordial serpents. Those are the true villains. <laughs> so Gwyn, uh, Gwyn. Uh, Let's see, Aldrich. Aldrich seems like a total villain as well. Pontiff. Uh, the Serpents. Both of them were how many victory? They're not only two, they're endless serpents. Uh, I don't see this guy as a villain. Again. Because I'm thinking of... Oh yeah, so let's not talk o only about bosses. Let's talk. Let's talk about all NPCs. Oh, of course, Lotric of Karim, the Golden Armor shithead from Dark Souls One. He's a villain, 100%. Patches is a minor villain. Uh, 
bad. It's kind of harder to find someone... Uh, someone that's truly villainous and not. Just having conflicting interest to the player. Not to the player! Why, uh, Aldrich just ate everyone? <laughs> he didn't give a fuck. I wish there was more story on those serpents. Uh, they legit might have been manipulating everyone behind this. Yeah, I think they did. I think they actually did. It might be a biblical uh, reference. You know, with the serpent, apple stuff. Maybe. I'm just saying. I'm not playing good, either. Um, like, Frida, she just wants to stay in, uh, in the painted world until it rots, instead of letting it be reborn, while the main character is, it's, is just a meddling bastard, more or less. <laughs> Whether that's bad or not is hard to say, considering the consequences the other inhabitants have to deal with. Well, to be honest, putting everyone out of their misery in the painted world is the best way to go. So I can't say you're... A lot of people say that the main character in Dark Souls is the bad guy. <laughs> like the biggest villain, which is us. In Dark Souls 3 is interesting that you can even choose to become the Dark Lord. I'm not sure if that... From what I've heard, that's the canon ending. Though I'm not sure how canon that is. Not sure if Miyazaki or someone from the actual, actually story, store, store lore slash story team, uh, in the, how do you call it, confirmed that. Yeah, but in the in the in Dark Souls Three is a bit more special by my standards, like. Uh, In Dark Souls 1, you're with the serpents. Like, the serpents appear. And in Dark Souls... Uh, 3... The... The Launder guys appear. Which I consider a bit... I consider a bit more interesting. Because we have a bit more lore on the Launder guys. On the Serpents, we barely have some lore, as Jolly Beardo said as well. I dodged too late. I healed in a bad uh, moment. You didn't think he's the villain? Greedy cunt? Wait, whom do you mean? Well, I consider him a minor antagonist. I don't care of his motives. He just does bad to other people. But yeah, Patches is a greedy cunt. <laughs> Uh, you're trying to fulfill the promise that Gwyn stole from you, that your race would inhabit the world. He's probably making the right choice and he uh, he was asked to do it by inhabitants of the world, Kena. Uh -huh. While the player isn't really affected by what happens to the world, so he's still meddling. Also, the main character rarely see farming hollows to level up, <laughs> and we were picking on Aldrich. Yeah, that's true, but Aldrich ate them, man. Uh, they, don't, they just come back anyways. forgot about that. That, 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 that hurt. Aldrich ate the Gwyn. Yes, Gwendolyn. Just trying to make a living. Patches doesn't care about killing for no reason. 
Well, he he kind of almost kills you in all of the <laughs> uh, all of the encounters. So. Sir Druk. Yeah, Welcome Sir Druk, how are you my friend? How was your stream? Hello Raiders! Actually I wanted to make this the last attempt, <laughs> but since you joined, I will do more attempts. Oh you played Cyberpunk, oh very nice. Oh no the boarding! How's the stream my friend? Please check out Druk, he's a very nice streamer. Oh my god, the chat, I lost the chat, oh no. Uh, yeah, they're just zombies by the time the player finds them, so... I guess lore-wise, killing a zombie is just putting them out of the misery. Though I would have loved more de details on going hollow. Damn. One hell of an adventure. Oh, 13 months, dude. Dude. Dude, thank you so much, man, for the 13 months of support. Thank you. Uh, Cyberpunk uh, 20, uh, 2077 got uh, launched on PS5 today, so you had to check it out. And how, how is it? Is it uh, enjoyable? Is it less buggy? Do you have a capture card? I assume so. Or you stream directly from the PS5. What you see here is the last boss in Dark Souls 3. Though it won't be the last boss for me. Because I have one more. Uh, which is optional. But I have this one and one more boss. And I will finish the Soul Level 1 challenge, my man. Come on, boy. Come here, boy. So far, so uh, it's good. Oh, <coughs> oh, yeah, I remember uh, uh, PS5 has the ray tracing on. Uh, I have Elgato 4K capture card. Ooh, that's sexy. That was made for the PS5. Yeah, you're lucky to buy it before the pandemic when it was only 100 euro. Uh, would you say CT is evil? Yeah. Yeah. Not pure evil, but yeah. He betrayed his kind. He went insane. Yeah, I find it at 400. Wait, what do you mean? Why did you buy at 100 euro? The PS4? <laughs> the PS5, I mean. Ah, the capture card. Yeah, I will need to buy one as well when I'll get the, the PlayStation. With 400 euros, you can get the damn PlayStation, man. <laughs> Would you uh, until you buy a PlayStation 5 if it was just <laughs> 100 euros? You can find a PS5 digital for 100 euros. I want to get the one with CD. Uh, and uh, 
So, say, talking in euros, I wouldn't pay more than 450 euros for it. Uh, or 400. It's not worth it for me. So, I either buy it uh, at 2000 drawn, basically, or I don't buy it at all. Oh, nice. I'm gonna read after the fight, guys. I'm sorry. Yeah, so I, I wanna get the one with the disc uh, version. Yeah, I know, that one is a bit more expensive, but... But instead of buying something I, I wouldn't like... Yeah, no thanks. Um... Uh, wait, wait. <laughs> PS5 Digital. <laughs> Good luck with that. PS5 with no disc reader. Uh, the one with disc is 500 euro. Yeah, 500 is okay, but I'm waiting for at least 50 euro less than that. I, I can buy it like that as well, but again, I, I can wait for that, so that's why I'm... I, uh... I can go. If you go to Orange Altex Mini Galaxy and uh, Physical Surge, you'll find them at the correct prices. They don't put them online anymore because robots will buy them. Uh, okay, that, that's bullshit. That was uh, it, it was some online hosted PS5 service or some shit. <laughs> if they have it in stock, in Russia we don't have it in stock. In Bucharest they should be in stock, but again. Uh, go to a physical store. Yeah, I'm actually I'm gonna go to a physical store out of curiosity to see if it actually is good or not. <laughs> Kim bitch. Oh yeah, I forgot about that. Hmm. I guess I should have dodged right in front of him. Oh yeah. Uh, you mean uh, you're not planning on getting a PS5 just yet, but at least uh, maybe soon you want to play uh, Demon Souls. Yeah, I want to play Demon Souls. I want to play Bloodborne at 60 FPS. <laughs> with but with some HD graphics maybe, like bet a bit better graphics. Not saying it doesn't have good graphics, but maybe just a bit uh like of a, a small upgrade, maybe. For higher resolution, let's see, I don't know. Uh, and at this point with those GPUs, to be honest, I, I would buy I would buy a PlayStation. So uh, as a economic plan I would actually buy a PlayStation just to not pay like a PlayStation is almost two times, yeah, it's two times cheaper than a GPU than the GPU I want. Actually, no, not not two times more expensive. Let's say uh, a GPU is with 50% more than uh, the PlayStation. So yeah. Go to the one. Uh, one of the big orange shops in Bucharest, like Vanessa or Orhidea. Uh, same for Altex stores. Yeah, yeah, I have, uh, I have Afi near me. I have Plaza near me. I can go to some Plaza as well, I guess. Uh. 
orange shops though what do you mean big orange shops actual orange do, do the they have of the dark do they have playstations that's orange what actual really since when what the fuck I didn't know that. I dodged. them up as well wait for a long time you thought Afi had an altex but it was a media galaxy and that was weird considering how often you go there uh altex and media galaxy is absolutely the same shit if you check out their websites you will see that it only has a different branding but the the website as like if you look at on how it looks like on the product prices, on the product stocks, it's exactly the damn same. I don't know why they don't do... They don't merge them in one of those. I really don't understand. Yeah, I didn't pay attention there. They were the same thing, different color, yeah. Uh, you mean Altex and Mega Galaxy are basically the same story? Uh, there is so much stuff on screen, it's mind boggling. <laughs> yeah, they basically copied the website template over and changed the ribbon color. They're the same. They, if I, I don't think, I don't think actually someone copied it. I think they're the same store, but uh, under some different. I, I never understood that under some different branding. Under the same owner. Altex is okay, but I had some issues with them. Uh, not, not big issues, but I ordered something. Uh, it didn't have all the accessories, and I I uh, messaged them like messaged them like almost two years ago. Still didn't get the reply. <laughs> so yeah. Uh, it didn't have a power adapter, it just came with the USB cable, so if I wanted to if I wanted to charge the thing uh, into the in the power outlet, I couldn't. Also, Flanko was shit. I, I paid the uh, I paid basically yeah 50 lei, 50 Romanian lei, whatever a run. A bonus, like in plus for um for a faster delivery on a TV. I, I wanted to get it the next day. And they sent it in like three days, and I was like, dude. Uh, 
I press too late. I pressed too late. Though I can't say I feel bad. Like, uh, we reach the, the second phase quite often, so this is good. Uh, this is the, the last try for today. And then I we're gonna do a just chatting pause and uh, end the stream. That doesn't mean I'm gonna I'm not gonna try my best. That didn't hit me. Nice. Uh, you're pretty sure they have the same stock as well, since every time you check whenever one thing's out of stock on Altex, it is also out of stock on Mini Galaxy. When when they made the website for one of them, they basically just took the other website and changed the logo and the colors. Yeah. Same for you with Flanco. Uh, what happened? Uh, what happened to you? Uh, with you with the uh, Flanco? So we we can discuss a bit about shops. If you want. Are you kidding me? Oh my god, that, that was very bad. That was... Oh look! <laughs> he got... He got... He got lightning on him. You hate that spell. <laughs> Beautiful. <laughs> oh my god. From what I remember, I think you can actually summon someone here. Though I'm not completely sure. Uh, the broken Wolfenstein CD case? That uh, damaged your... Ah, yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, but I guess it was solved, right? Like, uh... Like you got uh, the money back or you got the... Uh, no. Oh, so you basically had to buy it again? Like, uh, you had, you called it all, oh, uh, yeah. Yeah, buy the thing again. Yeah. 
Yeah, they they're uh, like whenever it, there is a problem, they uh, they don't do well. Uh, though, though, when, um, how do you call it, when, um, when I had issues with the ass's motherboard. Oh, yeah, also, two hours and 30 minutes and no, uh, and no crash. No crash. Hey, Mother Chan, welcome. Yeah, sadly, I'm ending, I'm sorry. I'm sorry, but I'm gonna stream more on Thursday. Uh... Yes, I reached the Gale. I killed the Half Light Spear of the Church. It, it was a pretty nice uh, experience. We were talking about shops and our issues with some of them. For example, Ema Emag is good. Emag is okay. The issue is, is that if you buy from someone else, like true Emag, like if you buy from, I don't know, you buy on Emag but from X seller. Uh, you need to read read their stuff. Uh, PC Garage, my opinion, is one of the best. Though on Emag, the prices might be lower sometimes. But sometimes the prices might be lower on PC Garage. <laughs> Fun fact, Emag owns PC Garage. Uh, Self.ro or Chell. Avoid it. Uh, if you want to buy stuff from them, buy cheap shit that you can replace, like cables, I bought cables, mouse, keyboards, uh, like very, very small stuff uh, that I, I w didn't care that much about, like if it was 50 lay, yeah, great, but not thousands of uh, stuff. Uh, for example, I've bought, uh, I've bought my first PC off from Emag, uh, it was, uh, I remember even today, it was 2500 run back then and it was very damn good like very everything like mm, hard drive ram power source unit uh, motherboard uh, G cpu uh, uh pc case uh and even a dvd uh, writer because i used the dvd so yeah very damn okay uh though I still have a hate on them slightly because uh, stuff on their website can be confusing. Like, uh, yeah, it's sold by those guys, but uh, yeah, it doesn't make any sense. So yeah, uh, I won't talk more about this because for the non-Romanian people here, it might be confusing. But yeah, I had the uh, issues with Altex and... Uh, with the delivery of Flanco, and that's it. The rest were okay. Oh yeah, and Epon dot Pro. Don't buy from those guys. You don't have warranty, <laughs> and you might if you have any any issues with the product. Good luck with that. Yeah. Uh, you're they're Hungarian from what I know. I don't have anything with Hungarians, but uh, I have something with those guys. They were the guys I bought the CPU from. The the motherboard, that first motherboard with issues. I have it here, broken. And it was still in the warranty they had. But it was my fault. It's really good. Yeah, because you didn't have any broken hardware. Wait until... You, I, I wish you don't have that, but if you will have you will reach my conclusion. Um, uh, is Disney of eShops? <laughs> yes, I agree. So yes, friends, we killed the Half-Light Spear of the Church. We reached the Gale, almost killed him several times, though still greedy, but uh, it's one of my favorite fights as well from all the Dark Souls games. Uh, I can't say it's my top one. I, I cannot choose a top one favorite. It's a very hard choice. Uh, but totally it's in the top list. It's It feels so fluid, so... Mm, like a dance. It's really nice. Uh, but the guy on the phone uh, said they are not at fault since you didn't request to open the package with the uh, courier. Oh my... This is what ha happened to it with Epon. Uh, I wanted to verify because... 
in the description of the order said you can verify the package when it arrives. And I told the guy, the courier, dude, I, I want to see if everything is right. And he was like, mm, yeah, you can check, but I kind of do a return for you. Not there. And I was like, you say what? <laughs> and uh, I looked at them, I saw it's okay, and then he went. Like, they're so rushing. They're like, oh my god, I have to go. Dude, wait for it. <laughs> I'm not taking more than three minutes because I've, yeah, I know. How, how is it? But still. You be careful when buying stuff on the mug, but at least they have fast shipping. Fast shipping and you can return it easily. Uh, with Altex, I had an issue. Uh, I had that issue that I didn't get one accessory, but I can go over that. The 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 other issue was with the, the Asus motherboard, though. That one I returned. No questions asked. They gave my money back in several days. All good. Cannot complain. You bought a current PC from a mug as well with cash. Uh, almost oh almost 1000 euros Ooh, nice nice very nice may you use it happily thank you for the stream i thank you everyone for being here i thank you teal bro mind for the raid um a lot of raids today i had i i've got one two three four raids guys really you're insanely awesome so teal bro mind thank you so much for the raid much appreciated it's Patty Cake as well. Thank you so much for the raid. Sour Wireless, thank you for the raid. And Druk, thank you as well for the raid. And also, Druk, thank you so much for the 13th, the 13th month of support with the tier 1 sub, man. Thank you so much. I appreciate you from heart. Fun is really good. Uh, oh, yeah, never mind. I, I read that. And you said the uh, delivery very fast because you wanted to pay with cash. Ah. That's what I do as well. Never pay with card if you want them to arrive fast. <laughs> so yeah. Uh, two more bosses, guys. Two more bosses. And I'm gonna do the... We! We are gonna do the Dark Souls 3 Soul Level 1 All Bosses Challenge. Damn. No Medir will be... Will be tough. I'm expecting it to be tough. Okay, so, pay attention to this. If you are a streamer, don't update to version 27.2 yet. <laughs> At least by my standards. It crashed my PC three times. I had to restart the stream three times. Like the PC. It froze, though I, I could hear the sound. I'm not sure what happened. It's something with metadata, staging failed, uh, something, something. Uh, staging failed, uh, blah, blah, blah. I, since I changed the version to the older one, no crashes. Uh, maybe uh, we have a log. Log files, crash reports. Do we have any crash report? Nope. Uh, log files. Oh yeah, I have a log file here. Memory leaks. Uh, let's see, date modified today. It's 15. Yeah, I restarted the stream three times. So this is basically the fourth stream <laughs> I started today. Let me look at the last log out of curiosity. Get transition data duration is negative. Uh, game capture attempting a hook full screen process. Hook not loaded yet. Attempting the texture sure it's successful. Okay, so I have no crashes in the logs. Yeah, I don't understand anything. Uh, usually get stuff through easy box. We have to pay with card. Yeah, I know the, I know the feeling, but. From what I know, you can opt in always for a courier. So yeah. Thank you guys for being here. It was a very successful stream by my standards. Even if I didn't kill, kill Gale today. Uh, I will feel very bad after I kill him. Because uh, I like the fight. So uh, this one I actually don't care how much time it will take. 
Uh, I'm thinking maybe next stream I will unlock the path to Midir and we try it as well. So yeah. Also, Fiznax, Kobo, Legatus Lex and Siri. Thank you so much for the follows as well. Uh, and as always, thank you everyone for joining. Let's see if we have someone to raid. And uh, oh my god, it's pretty late. Yeah. Oh yeah, Hollow Noob uh, plays Dark Souls 3. He's a very nice fellow. I uh, I discovered uh, not long ago, and uh, I think he will enjoy his content as well. He's very welcoming. He's a very new streamer. He doesn't even have affiliate, so let's help him get that affiliate. He's doing Dark Souls 3. Oh, oh wait, he's doing Dark Souls 3 SL1 all bosses as well. <laughs> very damn nice. So yeah, thank you so much, friends, again. Much appreciated. Oh yeah, he wait, he's an affiliate. Oh yeah, I forgot. Copycat, yeah, <laughs> I forgot. I saw he had uh, less than 50 followers, and I was like, wait. Yeah, I forgot he's an affiliate. Never mind. But doesn't matter. A copycat cap, yeah, exactly. No, you're awesome. Thank you, friends, for joining again. And as always, stay safe out there. Well fat. See you on Thursday at the same time. Goodbye. And good night. Er, good day.